Hi, Bob. This is Tony. Uh, we quickly spoke, I think it was Monday or Tuesday, and I mentioned that I wanted to send you over a quick video. So this is it. Um, what I want to do is give you three tips on how to increase your online presence in order to help you generate new business, specifically via your website. This is something that I do for free for small businesses. I'm not trying to sell anything. The only thing that I ask is if you find the information useful, just hit reply on the email and let me know your thoughts. Um, any feedback would be welcome, even if it's to say, Tony, thank you for the information, but I'm not interested in any help right now. That's totally fine. So what I want to do is go over three um, of Google's uh, top ranking factors. Those are content citations and backlinks. And content we'll start with, it's nothing more than the words and images here on your homepage. Google loves well-written authoritative content, and the more of it you can give it, uh, the happier it is. With that, or because of that reason, we suggest 1,500 to 2,000 words of content on a homepage. Um, sounds like a ton, but there's reasons behind it. So you have a 428 right now, so you could definitely, you know, more than triple that up. Um, the secondary reason for the amount of uh, words I'm talking about is for, um, let's say, pest control tamp. Sorry about that. I had to pause my recording for a second. So yeah, Pest Control Tampa, it um, is searched, I believe, 600 times, if not more, a month in the Tampa area. So you definitely want to make sure you've got that exact keyword here on your homepage. And there's going to be a lot more than just that one. There's a lot of variations to this keyword, and you'll see some of those here in a little bit. So what uh, I want to do is bring up your main competitor here. So Best Pest management is who shows up first in the organic listings. If we do a quick count on their content, there <laughs> you're actually beating them out on total word count. So um, when it comes to that, you know, if you get to 1,500 words, you're going to be beating them out of the park. So that's going to be easy to do. So that's content. What I want to do is move on to citations. And what that is, well, first of all, after we do this search, we get the sponsored ads here. These are paid ads if you need quick um, business. That's one way to get it. But I don't want to talk about paid ads today. I want to talk about the areas under here. This is called the map pack. About 50% of the search volume is going to call or click on one of these, or one or more of these listings. Question is, is how do you get yourself up here? And that's those citations I mentioned. That's nothing more than your company name, address, and phone number out on directory sites around the web. These are sites like Yellow Pages, White Pages, Yelp. Angie's List, Thumbtack, Porch, um, even Facebook. If you get your company added to 10 to 15 of those per week or so, over time you're going to see your Google business listing start rising in the ranks in this area. The only thing you want to keep in mind is you, you want to be super consistent with the way you input that data across the different directories. Consistency is key. So below here, this is called the organic listings, and these are more affected by something called backlinks. And all a backlink is is your website URL or address in a clickable format out on another website somewhere. It's essentially a vote for your site by that other site that has your link on it. And when I mean clickable, I mean, you know, you can highlight it and click it. So one thing to be aware of, not all backlinks are created equal. You don't want to go to fiverr.com or one of these cheap sites and pay somebody five bucks to give you 20 backlinks or something. You'll end up regretting it. You want to get backlinks from well um, trusted or highly trusted and um, if at all possible, niche relevant websites. So for you, it would be another pest management uh, website or pest control website, I should say, or even like a home and garden type website. Um, that would be pretty relevant to you. And a lot of those have blogs. So you could even write 500,000 words, um, an article of sorts, and reach out to one of those kind of uh, blogs and offer a trade. You know, you give them an article, which keep, helps them keep their blog active, which they like. They give you a backlink. So that's a, just a little pro tip. All right, so that's content webs, uh, content citations and backlinks. I want to take your competitor's URL here, put it into this product called AREFs, or tool called AREFs. Um, this is something I pay monthly for. It gives us some really good statistics on websites. Um, gives us a view of about what Google knows about a website. It's an estimation, but it's pretty good. So these guys have 71 of those backlinks I was just talking about. They're being found for 233 keywords. That's getting them approximately 228 clicks. So if I click into those keywords, yeah, see Pest Control Tampa, 600 volume. This shows them in position one or two. They're actually in position one now. This just hasn't been updated yet. 
the position one gets you a third or so of the click. So this should be more like 230 traffic for one keyword. Then you got this Tampa Pest Control, um, Pest Control Tampa FL. You know, these are all different keywords and they all have their own search volumes. But just for this one, say 233, say they close 10% of those uh, clicks to their website. That's 23 new clients a month, free and clear. Because once you're ranking up in that area, as long as you maintain it, you're getting that traffic for free. I don't know what 23 new clients a month would do for you. Maybe you're busy as it is, but um, you know somebody out there I'm sure would love it. So let's compare that to your site. All right, so 28 backlinks. You're being found for 11 keywords and zero traffic. Let's see what uh, keywords. All right, so you got some uh, keywords. Wait a minute. Uh, Pest Control St. Pete FL. That's only 10 searches. Pest Control Pinellas County, 70 searches, but you're way out on page nine. Like pretty much everything here, even your company name. Um, if this is even your pump company name, this may be some other Bob's. I don't. This could be a, uh, a uh, not necessarily a local keyword. This could be anywhere in the country. Pest Control St. Pete FL ten. So yeah, what it comes down to, um, Bob, is you, the content you have on your homepage is just doesn't have the keywords in it you need to be found for. So that's causing you a problem first and foremost. That's your foundation. You got to get the keywords in there. Then you go after citations and backlinks to help push those keywords higher in rank so you can get onto page one and start getting some call volume from your website. All right, well, that's really all I've got for you right now. I don't want to go on forever. Um, hopefully this information was enlightening at the least. If it was, um, or even if it wasn't, you know, just hit reply. Let me know, you know, Tony, thank you, but no thank you. Or, you know, I found this information useful. I'm going to try to use some of these on my own. Or if you want to work on your site but aren't inclined to do it yourself, I'm right down here in Sarasota. I'd love to chat and see if I can be of assistance to you. Um, so with that, Bob, I will let you go. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.